welcome to another QuickBooks Training Moment with Steiner Business Solutions. I'm Doug and today we are going to go over cleaning up your lists in QuickBooks. Um, yeah, there are a number of different lists that QuickBooks has. Um, the more popular ones are chart of accounts, item lists. These are things pretty much everyone has. There are a number of other lists you could have if you use these functions in QuickBooks. But you also have customer lists and vendor lists. So we're going to go into the customer center for our example today. Over time, as you sell to many customers over the years, your list of customers or vendors can get out of hand and become huge and unwieldy so that when you're scrolling through the drop down menu to enter a new bill or a new invoice, uh, it can take you a while to get to the one you're looking for. And you may find that a lot of these customers or vendors are outdated and not used anymore. So what you can do in QuickBooks is inactivate them so that they don't show up on your list anymore. So let's just pick an example here. Let's say uh, Carol Corcoran here. We haven't used her in years. So I don't want to delete any history of her. I just don't want her to show up on my list anymore so that my list can get a little bit smaller. All you have to do is right click her name and choose make customer job inactive. And there she goes. She disappears. Again, her history has not disappeared. She's just not showing up on the list anymore. If you go up here, you'll notice that it's only showing active customers. If I change this to all customers, it's going to show me active and inactive customers. And there she is, Carol Corcoran. There's a little X by her. That means she's inactive. So now you can go back and look at any customers or vendors that you made inactive. And you can even make them active again if you want. Again, I right-click them and make the customer active. Now they're on your active list. As long as you're only showing active customers, all of those ones that you made inactive will not show up on your list, make your list a lot shorter, a lot cleaner, and a lot easier to get through. You can use this function with customers, with vendors, like I said, with chart of accounts, any expense income accounts that you don't use, you can get rid of that way. Item list, things from your item list that maybe you don't use anymore. Just make them inactive and it'll make your list a lot smaller. So I hope this was helpful. Thanks.